Yo, 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 what is going on guys? Lottery Sykes here. Today we have another AMC stock price prediction video. I would ask you to please hit the like button and please hit the subscribe button. Consider joining the fam. Let's get right into the video. Also guys, just opened a free Discord about a day or two ago and we have just about 60 members. It is free. We just talk stock. So if you want to join that, link is in the description. Now let's get into the video. Charles Payne dropped this nice hot tweet on us. SEC chairman says in Barron's interview that ban of payment for order flow is on the table. Hashtag AMC, GME, hashtag hood. And he tags Gary Gensler, would love to follow up. Our producing broker will ring your office again. Thank you. This is beautiful, guys. So the SEC is looking into things that we want them to look into so we don't have to really jump on their backs. I know it's taking a while, but you guys can see payment for order flow ban is on the table. Beautiful. And if you don't know what payment for order flow is, it pretty much means that brokers um, get paid. Brokers get paid by market makers for market makers to route orders to wherever they want. So your order could be routed through dark pools and not go on live exchanges so that's pretty much what this means guys a lot of this happens through amc and gamestop so that we don't see the price action that we would actually organically see so guys over here on stock tracker 200,000 shares available to borrow not much for tomorrow 40,000 calls expiring in the money not much as of now so not much is really happening behind the scenes but this number was bigger earlier and as you guys can see Short interest has gone up by a small amount. There was um, bets, uh, shares borrowed against AMC today. So that's another beautiful thing to see. Utilization rising. Short interest, 17.42% of free float. Utilization, 92.92%. Everything is looking beautiful. Everything is lining up. Uh, options chain, 40,000 calls in the money. 99,000 out of the money being ready to be put in the money. Barely any puts in the money. And 80,000 being ready to put in the money that ain't gonna happen right we are all in for the calls now there's a lot going on around saying don't buy call options on amc because they do play us they play us in this options game and i've seen it time and time again so i'm just letting the calls i own ride out but i will not be buying more calls on amc now as for technical side of things the daily candles couldn't look better right guys uh personally I was expecting us to have that jump today that we didn't really see. We did make some nice highs, right? We What did we hit today? We hit around like 45.71. That's not crazy, right? I thought we were going to at least hit the $50 range. 45.71. And now here's, here's the problem, right? Obviously, we had a nice strong morning and midday and no one was really expecting that dip, right? Well, now we see some heavy resistance at this 44 dollar line and we thought what we had was a clean break but now we have to fight against this level and personally i think by the time we break it we are going to get stopped at this 45 50 range somewhere around there for more resistance right we have to break a few key levels before we can just jump and start breaking out and you guys seen what happened today was we had this touch over here a couple days ago on the $48 mark, uh, 48, right about here. And it barely touched, but we had one before. So what I'm looking for is another touch up against that. So tomorrow, hopefully slightly green. And this is kind of just the technical side of things, but I'm going to give you my bias opinion right now. So if we pop out on the daily candles, personally, I'm not looking at the close levels to be too significant right now, right? I'm looking for that jump up to the $53 level. I think $53.50 is going to be a very, very, very strong level of resistance that we are going to have to break through. Because as you guys seen, look at all of this support. And if you don't know, support eventually acts as resistance. And I think that is pretty much what you're going to see when we get up there so we have a few lines to break through you know we have to break through at 44 clean 45 48 50 and then that 53 50 i think we may struggle a little bit on guys but i do see it coming this week and that's all that matters because 
watching these videos, you're just looking at clarification. You're not going to sell your position. Chances are you're an ape that is diamond handing, that has been diamond handing, and you're just looking for clarity, right, guys? So I'm telling you right now, I'm expecting those highs of the week at least around that $53 mark, and I think we are going to have some trouble at that $53, $50 range. Mark my words when we get up there, guys. Um, honestly, there's not much more to really to give out to you, but on the short side of things, on the very, very short term side of things, I think that we were oversold at the end of the day, right? I don't think we should have broke under 4350. Uh, we seen some support there throughout the day and I think that was a pretty decent level honestly to stay at personally We're oversold and I think we are going to jump back up to the 45 level tomorrow And what I'm really watching is 48 tomorrow. So guys keep in 48 tomorrow Honestly, if you see those dips in pre-market Just watch $42, right break under there It's gonna be a whole new ball game and then you're gonna watch that support at 40 etc so on and so forth that's pretty much all i got for you guys for today join the free discord if you want to talk stocks find out best picks find out some plays for the next trading day whatever it may be just hop in hang out and have fun um hit the like button on the video if you got anything out of it consider subscribing if you want to join the fam if not it was nice meeting you sayonara lottery stocks out the hooligan how we gonna get to this guy when we focus on coming but trapping this one that we got all of us gonna make your one day like church